to be clear, concise, and lastly, to use a human who's surviving with nothing more than a tent on the human's back with a dream of a PhD doctorate medical degree for children. Has so much disgustingness, I can't complete a sentence I now began. Interfering, disrupting, talking about, thinking about next to, observing, noticing, and experimenting on a human other humans are using to benefit them and everyone else has to do with the worst evil humans have ever caused in outer space. Not giving the person the human who's used as a lab experiment any other option other than surviving or suicide and suffering. In other words, already suffering, suicide and suffering, all suffering. And meanwhile, humans are looking at the person, talking about the person, laughing at the person, telling the person what to do. When the person's not talking to them, when the person's not next to them, when the person's not even paying attention to them with their awareness. Thinking about what to do with the person, thinking and thinking and having so much thought about a human surviving. And never, ever bothering to interact with the person other than shh. Not only has what I'm talking about, no inspiration, no motivation. But explains a lot of false information in medicine and health and world. About what humans are doing to other humans appreciating stimulation and using them as stimuli with the eventual economic reward they all enjoy but I can't ever obtain I can't ever achieve within these conditions I'm describing living amongst humans who use me financially and disregard me as having a disability and disabled. Reading all the books that everyone uses for their behavior their time in mathematics and their language of suffering involving theory and philosophy. But never explaining 
why they're doctors and surgeons and teachers and professors and PhD candidates and I am nothing more than what they call me here at the University of Washington. A retard. 